All right. Tell me what brings you in. So I'm a performer, dancer. What kind of style you dance with? Mostly like uh, freestyle, like a Michael Jackson moonwalking. Like, like pop, lock, and drop pop and, Well, not the drop it part, <laughs> but the pop, locking. yes. Some people know me as Michael Jigsaw, like the puzzle, because I can isolate my body like a puzzle piece. Maybe yeah. by the end. Do, 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 do. I can't do it. <laughs> you got a little something there. How long you been dancing? I've been dancing for 20 years. No, oh, awesome. As time goes by, I notice that my body can't do certain things the way I normally would do it without feeling some type of soreness, especially under my feet, calf and the ankles, okay. and in my legs. OK. Do a lot of footwork. This type of isolating dance moves requires a lot of the human body. I decide, let's do some dance moves and figure out if any of these particular dance moves maybe recreate the pain. All right, give me, give me a little move. A lot of the times, I, I have to contract my muscles. Are there any of these particular movements that create more pain? Uh, it's mostly when I do my lower back. And then sometimes when I do isolation, sometimes I can feel some pain in my neck. Whenever I move this way and wave like that, wave like that. You can really see how much work it is to really isolate each joint, the shoulders, that scapular range of motion that he has. We're definitely going to take a look at that once again on my table. You comfortable with me touching your feet? I'm a little ticklish, but I'm excited. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I've always been nervous with chiropractors. I don't know why. Because I'm always afraid that something can always could possibly go wrong. Or If I go to the wrong chiropractor and I get hurt, then I just can't do my job. I am not a martial artist. My job is not to perform jujitsu or rip your head off like in the movies. I think what makes people nervous about chiropractic is people are lacking in the education of chiropractic. And when you're not educated about something, it can create more fear. You're not the first. I can't tell you how many people actually think they're going to come in here and I'm performing some kind of like, <laughs> So before we do a full body adjustment, we decide to look at the toes and the ankles. You really <laughs> are very stiff when I take you into plantar flexion here versus the dorsiflexion, but you still, wow, you're extremely flat-footed. This is not good. Ooh, his foot was so flat that if I put a wooden board up to it, it would measure up to it. I can only imagine the type of pain he might be going through right now. <laughs> 